Toulouse were on a horrible run of five consecutive defeats. The Difficile were rock bottom of the championship with 12 points, desperate for a win to take them closer to safety. They welcomed Monaco to the stadium. Leonardo Yardim's side had lost to Bordeaux last time around and without Islam Slimani suspended, the Algerian a costly absence for the Principality side. He had six goals and eight assists to his name this season. The game started very well for the visitors. A penalty inside five minutes. Jean-Kevin Augustin fouled. VAR judging the referee had made the correct decision and upstepped Wissam Ben Yedda, Monaco's top scorer, adding another goal to his name from the spot. Toulouse were the better side in the first half to save you with a cross. Sangare blasting over from close range. An opportunity and a chance that should have seen Toulouse draw level. But Sangare, the Ivorian, just lacking a little bit of composure. It didn't matter as Max Alain Gradel was brought down by Balatouré. Clear foul by the Monaco left back. A penalty converted by Yaya Sanigo, almost kept out by Benjamin Leconte, but the former Arsenal man tucking it away. Paulo Toure, who gave away that penalty, almost put his team back in front. The defender hitting the crossbar from close range. Antoine Comboire unhappy with his team's performance during that first half, and Toulouse came back with much more attacking endeavours. The ball falling to Leia Isika, but his shot went wide. A substitution for Monaco. Jelson Martins coming on. Very tricky player. And it proved to be a mastermind by Yardim Benyeda. Combining with Fabregas, Benyeda keeping the ball in well. And Martins there to pounce at the back post and put Monaco ahead. In the end, a 2-1 win for Monaco away from home. They stay in the bottom half of the table, but are just four points off the top four. Alarm bells for Antoine Comboire and Toulouse, who lose their sixth straight game.